I, I think everybody should be worried. Like, I am now more than convinced that everybody should be worried. We should be worried about the way DA has such confidence to uh, Ramaphosa. The way these guys have this confidence to Ramaphosa. No, 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 no. Now, there's this old man that was talking about, or was talking for ETA, and in his speech, what got me, what got my my attention is the fact that he's saying if the the, the government in Gauteng does not allow ETA to get what it wants, then the TA will then go to Ramaphosa and tell Ramaphosa. Ramaphosa will come down and you know what I'm saying uh, to Panyazali Sufi because for that alone it tells me that the confidence they have in. I, 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 in Ramaphosa. No, 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 no. No, guys, no, 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 no. Calling the off. Guys, calling the off. I, no, 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 no. No. Guys, I want to, the, 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 I'm going to insert a video. I want you to, to listen to this video, especially towards the end of the video that I'm about to insert. The words that this man is saying, no, it doesn't give me peace, guys. It has never given me peace. It will never give me peace. But I'm super worried. No, 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 I'm worried, guys. Nah. The, the confidence, but remember, he, the Houghton government said, no, listen, not long ago, while there was negotiations of EGNU, this very DA, somewhere voted against the ANC and they voted with EEFF. If they were committed and they were faithful and they were principled, why didn't they show such? Why now? We must consider their feelings and treat them as the, the first priority. But so they said somewhere, I forgot where, where the DA right now voted against the ANC. Number two, the Houghton provincial leadership, they are saying, oh, we get it, we get it. We, don't, we understand. But what we are also saying is, we, we 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 were given something by the look by, by 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 national it's a framework and we were told everyone look we must invite everyone we must allow everyone to participate we were never told to treat da as a special don don they are not special they are just like any other political party we do not care about the A's feelings. We invited the A equally as others. The A comes and dictate terms and say, do not work with that small party. Guys, don't you see the similarities there, right? Oh, oh you guys, it's so, that's in, so weird. But there's something that is not weird, and it's this. If you are not yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Come on, good people, because to subscribe, it is free. To like the video, it is free. To comment in the comment section below, it is free of charge. To click the notification bell, it is free of charge. To share this video, it is free of charge. To watch this video until the end, it is free of charge. Also, good people, I mean, come on, to watch the ads, it's free of charge, and that's how you financially contribute to this YouTube channel. Speaking about financial contribution to the channel, you can join, become a member of this YouTube channel from as little as 20 rand a month. You can also uh, use the Super Thanks Party. In case you don't want to do that, guys, there is a way where you can use my media company banking details to donate to the channel. And you know what I'm saying? We'll bring you more. And also, guys, want to buy more equipment so the power is in your hands please do the honorable thing as we proceed okay so yeah so we know the ETA according to them they deserve special privileges they deserve yes I do remember uh, I, I wouldn't lie I do remember Helen Zeller saying that the agreement that they signed with the ANC it also transcend into what is going to happen at a provincial level. I do remember, if I if I remember vividly, they did say that uh, provinces that are going to be affected is Gauteng 
and uh, it's Gauteng and um, KZN. But again, if they sign an agreement, if the, 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 the national leadership signs an agreement that affects the province, then technically the, the local the province does not have uh, their own minds or they don't have uh, look at the intellect of themselves to think for themselves. They really don't, right? Whatever happens in national, it affects down there. But the people up below, they are saying, Tina, we're not bought. So we can tell us that we should up co co comply with the decision that was made by people who are bought there. It's not what I said. Take a look at what the DA said here. The, there seems to be a crisis in Gauteng. You believe that it's small issues that are not insurmountable. This essentially can be resolved. Is that your view? Well, Premier Panyaza Lesufi has forgotten that he's only the Premier because the DA voted for him. Firstly, secondly, he's in the first stage of grief which is denial that the voters rejected him and his party because they were unsatisfactory as the rulers of Gauteng over the last few years. And he needs to take those into account. And the third thing is he's got 28 seats and the DA has got 22. And he mustn't now be greedy and try to grab far more than he's entitled to. The DA really wants to make Gauteng work and wants to make the Sufi look good for a change and our own people to look good but the most important thing is to serve the people of this province. In your view if these two parties are unable to find each other could it place the national government in jeopardy? No I, I don't think it would do that the national government has set the, uh, the tone and the example and I'm quite sure that if Mr. Lesufi is unreasonable, uh, the DA won't agree with him and if he's unreasonable, President Ramaphosa will take out the whip. So for me, it speaks of people that are very much entitled. Um, it speaks of people, I'm checking something guys. Uh, it speaks of people that are very much entitled. It speaks of people that are. It speaks of people that are. They, 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 they. It's not only that they are entitled. Sorry, guys. There's something that I was checking here. It's not only that they sound entitled, but they also sound forceful. And to, guys, where have you heard this? That uh, if you don't do this, this is what is going to happen. It can only, but Ramaphosa won't get jalolo. It is Ramaphosa that has made the DA so arrogant and so disrespectful. It is Ramaphosa. If it was not Ramaphosa, that this DA, this DA people will not have been this disrespectful. This DA people will be respective of other of other people. But unfortunately, I shame they are very, 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 very disrespectful. And I was listening to this and I was like, I kind of felt like, why is DA disrespecting uh, look, the, the intelligence of the people, look, of the government in Gauteng? Simply because of Ramaphosa. Ramaphosa has brought, Ramaphosa has brought uh, this country into disrepute, uh, making these people feeling so confident that they, they think now they control everything. Nobody's going to tell them because they are guy. Mr. Ramaphosa, Buga, what he has done. L like, look at what he has done. For real, guys. Like, for real. Real, 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 real. For real, guys. I was lying. Yes. I was lying. Hey, I was lying. Yo. Hey. <laughs> That's the more I think about it, the more I, I kind of feel like I was lying. Yes. I was lying. Imagine you are a provincial structure. You have to think and come up with your own ways, but you are bound by a decision made by Ramaphosa for you, a decision that at the end of the day, it will not reflect on Ramaphosa, but it will reflect on you. What type of leadership is this? You tell the premier to include ETA, not on merits, but on an agreement that you signed with the DA. What type of leadership is this?
Guys, we must be worried about Ramaphosa. Telling you guys, we really have to be worried about Ramaphosa. There are worrying signs there that I personally think we are not paying attention to, but there are worrying signs. Maybe it, it begs the question, well, is Ramaphosa a good leader? If he is, why are the decisions that are being made? Like, What's the point of being a premier if a decision, if decisions are made or taken by somebody else for you? So what's the point? Why can't we just de demolish the office of being a premier then? Because you look, the, the, the person who makes the decision on top for you below and they just tell you who to include. What if when you feel like this person is not worth the visions we are having in Gauteng, they will contaminate that so we don't want them. So what if that's the case? What if Panyaza Sufi and their look and his leadership, what if they feel that way? Honestly, slay Lula Maposa. I love Babalo Slide. Yarr.